traders, hope you have a great start to the week. I'm on the dollar count, got my monthly, weekly, day support and resistance levels all drawn in there in the description below. I'll just discuss some of the closest to price action. Now the dollar CAD had a strong move up last week, breaking above 132.62 monthly resistance. It's now testing last month's high. Struggling here at the moment. This week, are we able to move above? Does it become support for a move higher? Being quite overstretched here, we could well see this area hold as resistance for a move back down the range. So watch for intraday failure. If you see that, we could be seeing a reversal back down the range from last month's high. Now the dollar franc rejected 87.57 last week. It's just managing to hold on monthly support in the short term, 86.99. But has the overall rally finished? The higher time frame trend is down. Will we see a break back below 86.99? Does that become a resistance for a move down to re-challenge your weekly support at 85.69? All right, trades on to dollar yen. Now we advanced last week, almost tested 143.98 day resistance, and then had a two-day reversal. Just managing to close yesterday back above 142.17, which is a monthly resistance level. So can the advance continue and come up and retest 143.98 this week? And can we challenge 145.06 through the course of the month? Now, if you do see a lower top form, then have the anticipation that we may be topping out at the top of this range. So does the advance continue or do we see a lower top form or a move back below that monthly resistance level at 142.17. All right, trades on to Euro Pound. Last week we failed up here at 86.58, weekly resistance, pulling back. Can we put in a further higher bottom? As a trader, I'd like to see a pullback to DAG support. 85.84, can that hold for a further move up to challenge 86.58 and can we move above that level if you come back up to that level and once more starts to reject expect then a move back down the range so can the uptrend hold and retest 86.58 this week okay moving on to New Zealand yen last week we rejected monthly resistance 8816 and we could be putting in a lower top up here on the weekly chart so with that in mind I will be watching this weekly level of resistance this week can we rally back to that level hold and start to reverse for a move down to test day support 8613 to move lower this week moving lower potentially in line with the lower top forming up here on the weekly chart. All right, traders, let's better review for the day New Zealand dollar. It's been having a very good sell off. It may have sold down to the bottom of this range from low to high. Can the downtrend continue? Over the last couple of trading days, we've been holding at broken support 61.20. We might see another test of that level this week. So, can 61.20 be resistance this week? to move down to challenge 60.50 once more and can we move down and through again US CPI data release on Thursday will that be positive or negative for the US dollar so it's going to be difficult ahead of that data release but at the moment does 61.20 holders resistance for a further decline at the moment to test at 60.50 and can we move down and through that level this week Okay traders, that's my analysis for today. If you want to keep up to date with my analysis, simply subscribe to the channel. I look forward to seeing you next time. Now if you'd like to follow my Forex trading analysis throughout the week, why not subscribe to the ACY Securities live interactive trading feed Telegram channel. Simply contact Nathan Bray at acy.com to get access. Are you looking to improve your trading? Join Duncan Cooper, Senior Market Strategist and Trading Mentor at ACY Securities as he shares his knowledge on the global Forex markets.
The upcoming webinars for this week, 8th of August, Forex Trading, Live Market Analysis. During this webinar, Duncan will review 12 currency pairs, determine the key support and resistance trading levels for the week ahead, discuss his favorite risk to reward trading opportunity, and answer your trading questions. 9th of August, bringing it all together. How to identify high probability trading levels for the trading day. 10th of August, Live Forex Market Review, identifying high probability trading levels. Don't miss these live interactive webinars that will help you improve your trading.